hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel hope you are doing great today i'll be teaching you how to make a simple yet easy stuffed garlic cheese bread so let's get started before we get started make sure that you subscribe and like my youtube channel so you can be in touch with all my recipes first to start with this bread we are going to take lukewarm water make sure the water is not very warm add yeast add honey if you don't want to add honey you can add caster sugar and keep it aside for 10 to 15 minutes till it becomes double in size or you can say frothy once that is done in another bowl we are going to add a flour to it and we are going to add all the herbs that we require for garlic bread here i have taken oregano chili flakes rosemary you can take any other herbs that you like So after taking maida in a bowl we are going to add the yeast mixture into it and start making into a dough make sure that you knead it very well you might need to add some extra water in order to knead the dough really well once the dough is kneaded it will be a little dry so that's why we'll add a little bit oil to it and again knead it really well so that it becomes nice and soft so if the dough is always kneaded well that means it will prove better and your product will also come out well You can even dust some flour on the on your table and start kneading it so that you know you can get a good knead and the dough can get a chance to activate the gluten in it so that your bread will turn out more soft and fluffy. Once that is done, keep it aside and proof it for another half an hour till it becomes double in size. So now your dough has become double in size. We are going to punch it out. You can add some herbs on top again if you want. But now divide the dough into two parts. So once you have divided the dough into two parts, take one part, roll it out. and add your cheese to it here i have used mozzarella cheese but you can use any other cheese that you like now the same way take the other dough and roll it so i have rolled both the doughs in a round shape you can make it any other shape you have so now take the second dough put it on top of the cheese and make sure that you you know close your dough very well make sure the edges are packed really tight so that the cheese doesn't come out Now again proof this dough put it in a baking tray you can add more herbs or oil which you like on top of it and proof it for another half an hour Once that is done we are going to bake it for at least 20 to 25 minutes till it's getting a golden finish on top Once it's light golden that means your bread is done Let it cool down. Once it's cooled down, cut it into slices as you like it. And I have used a uh, pizza sauce. You can use any other sauce that you like, and you can enjoy the bread. Thank you.